Hello and welcome to the Vita Weekly Update, where I take the news of the week and compress it into a bite-sized video. Apologies for forgetting to mention this last week, but Tales from the Borderlands was also announced for Vita during the E3 conference as well. No date or price as of yet. The Swapper, being published on Vita by Curve Studios, is now due to hit on the 5th of August in North America and the 6th of August in Europe. Crossbuy has been confirmed and discounted pre-orders will be available in early July. IAVT Colorful, the Vocaloid rhythm game by the producer of Senran Kagura, has been pushed back to the fall of 2014 from the end of July. No reason was given for the delay. There's still no localization details. Dungeon Travelers 2, a spin-off of dating simulator 2 Heart 2, is coming to Vita on September 25 in Japan. The game is a remaster of a PSP game similar to Criminal Girls, with the updated version including better graphics and a 3D map. No details for localization. Sony XDev Europe has announced that Ovo Sonico's title, Murasaki Baby, will be coming to the PlayStation Network sometime in September. Regions and prices were not confirmed. A surprise release this week, Magical Beat, one of three Arc System Works developed PSN games, released this week on the American store. The game is $10, no details for a European release. And finally this week, an Oli Oli patch is released in Europe with the US version coming shortly to help fix several crash issues with the game. There was also a Borderlands 2 patch to help fix several of its issues. That's it for this week. Like, subscribe, comment, and share the video around if you liked it. See you next week!